Today we're talking about Gutenberg, the block editor. No, it's firstly not cake, not cake at all, that's Battenberg. And secondly, not scary. I promise, not scary. If you're new to WordPress, creating these beautiful looking websites or blog posts particularly can be a little bit daunting, but that is actually what Gutenberg is here for. It's here to turn you from some kind of no code mm. chump into a block editing champ. So with all that hyperbole, what actually is it? What is the block editor? If you've watched some of my other videos on WP Beginner, firstly, thank you very much and do get subscribed. And secondly, I use this comparison a lot because it just works. You have to imagine your content being built like Lego bricks. That's basically the block editor. Instead of using clunky text boxes, you're going to get bite-sized blocks for images, headers, paragraphs, and more. Drag them, drop them, rearrange them however you see fit. You can be a four-year-old with Lego again, ignore the instructions entirely, smash everything to pieces, and build it how you want. And personally, I am thanking the Gutenberg, because before the block editor, there was the classic editor, which was very text heavy. This way, much easier, much better for beginners, and a lot less clunky. The Gutenberg block editor comes free with WordPress. You don't have to pay for it, but there are also drag and drop page builders that can be even more powerful. We would definitely recommend checking out Seedprod. This is our absolute favorite page builder. It's incredibly powerful. Some of the things you can do with it are amazing. With page builders, you're also gonna find things like pre-made templates. It's gonna make your life even easier. Gutenberg is great, but your page builders are gonna be able to add all the bells and whistles. Back to the block editor itself, and it comes loaded with blocks for all of your content needs. You've got paragraphs, lists, images, galleries, you name it, you're gonna be able to find a block for it. Each block is also fully customizable. You wanna bold some text in a paragraph? Easy, done. You wanna crop an image? Not a problem. All you need to do is play with the settings in the sidebar. It's really easy and really great. But wait, there's more. There's even blocks for things like fancy call to action buttons or even embedding YouTube videos. And if you wanna get really fancy, you can even create your own. Now, if you're brand new to WordPress, you've got the block editor right there. You've probably been using it the whole time. If you're been on WordPress for a while like us, then you've probably got some content that has been made with the classic editor. Now, don't worry, you can actually still edit that using the block editor, which is very nice. And if for some reason you're feeling a little nostalgic, you can actually disable the block editor and go back to the classic if you really want to. Probably tell by the look on my face, I, do, I don't want to. Don't, don't make me. I mentioned earlier that I really love using Seedprod as a page builder. Well, if you want more information on that, click the link down in the top pinned comment or in the description. If you want some more information on how to use blocks in a really beginner friendly way, then check out one of these videos right here.